Okay, Libra. My name is Lisa, in case you've never been to my channel. And I'm going to try and get this done quick because healing. That's what's going on. Healing after juggling. I feel like whatever you're going through, it's taken a lot of courage and strength for you to get through it. I don't know um, what's going on, but I have tried to make your videos several times and it just keeps like stopping and and it's not even that it keeps on stopping it's like it the video disappears like I don't have any like um I feel like I don't know if you've been having a lot of interference in your life or what or if just somebody just doesn't want you to hear this somebody's like trying to block me from saying it I don't know All right, three cards for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign for the month of September 2019. So this is general, so if it doesn't resonate, check your other signs. If I say it's you, it could be the other person and, you know, vice versa. So, all right, so. There is four ones, okay, but it was like upside down. So I don't know if there's been an ending within um, a connection or you're moving. This is about stability. There's like something about your stability that's been like turned upside down. Let's see. Yeah, some of you might be moving, okay? Literally moving across the country, across internationally. But you're closing out cycles uh, within... A family unit with the, like just closing out cycles. This is the this is the world card, so it's like it's it's closing out one cycle of your, of your life to start another one. You know, then then we go on the um, the next card is the zero card, the the uh, the fool card. Okay, taking a leap of faith forward to move in a different direction. All right, so one more card plus the bottom of the deck for Libra, please. Yeah, wow. And there's the full right there. I feel like a decision's been made because some of those other cards, it's like uh, there was a resistance. There was like... Uh, non-communication there was like things not being discussed yeah look somebody's like very I feel like you're getting kind of a lot of shit about this new beginning that you want all right yeah here it is people are you may have had to cut some people out of your life um, kind of forcefully and this is also A truth it's like I feel like I feel like somebody had some sort of awareness here because the energy is like totally shifted here Whew. this is you feeling um, free Yeah, you're closing out one side of your life. It's like whatever whatever your life has been up until this point, I feel like that's all ending for you. And it's like you're you're transitioning, starting a whole other phase, and it's 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 gonna bring you a lot of um, fulfillment, emotional fulfillment. All right, give me two more cards here for Libra. Yeah, this has been a long, a long uh, journey. There is. See, this is the Nine of Swords. This this kept showing up, okay, in your other readings that I've been trying to do for you. So I do feel like some sort of, um, you've probably been in this energy for a, a while, maybe even nine months or nine weeks, uh, just, just stressing out. 
going back and forth. There's two nines here, so it's like you're almost at completion, which is right here. This is like you are headed towards some new beginning that's going to be stable and let's see. You, you, I feel like you want to offer stability to someone as well. Maybe that's been what's taken you so long to decide. All right, one more card here for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign. Yeah, look, and here's the four ones again. There's some sort of regret going on here. It's taken you a long time to be willing to let go of some sort of loss here. I don't know. I don't know what you lost. Let's see. What? But here's this four of wands. The four of wands comes up, came up twice. So some of you, this could be a spiritual union. A lot of this is like seen as like the twin flames card. But you know, it first came out upside down you know, and it flew off and came out upside down. So it's like something may have ended. Let's see. What is this five of cups about? Yeah, there's a resistance and here's this. Seven of wands. It's like somebody doesn't want to let go of something, but I'm not quite sure what, what that is. I feel like it's going to be different for everybody. But here's the emperor. Like what I said, it's like there's a divine union here. So somebody is showing up as the emperor. Who's this knight of pentacles? Tell me about this knight of pentacles. That's about communication and and truth, and that's that's somebody being clear about a decision. Because remember, I told you it's like there's been some sort of there was like somebody couldn't talk. I feel like somebody wants to um, communicate and offer love, and maybe uh, I'm sorry, my. Somebody else is a little bit guarded because they've been hurt. Maybe it's like you taken. Let's see. What else between this Nine of Pentacles? Yeah, look at this. Ten of Cups, emotional fulfillment, and then the, the Knight of Pentacles. This is about. Um, wow. Okay, so the, I, some of you could have like lost, um, a lot of money recently. But this is also, um, you know, like something ended and now you're single, like somebody was just like suddenly single. And I feel like you kind of been in mourning about this, you know, because you thought that this was like something was going to bring you emotional fulfillment, but it didn't.
And now you want to like bring truth to somebody, truth and stability. But it's like somebody is like still in mourning over this loss. Like, so I don't know if like you were suddenly single or like somebody else was suddenly single. Clarify this tower. What is this tower and nine of pentacles about? What is this tower and nine of pentacles about? Yeah, there's like some some sort of um, betrayal here. Yeah. And you found yourself single. Somebody single. I mean, this is like somebody getting away with something. Yeah, it's like, it's like somebody was betrayed here. This person was betrayed, okay, by you or, or you were betrayed by this person and, it, and, and all of a sudden you're single and it just was like devastating, total tower moment because you or this person was your wish fulfillment. But now somebody wants to step forward with the truth and they've been like very slow with the... Yeah, forthcoming with the truth. Okay, but but whatever ended when this ended, because I'm they just keep reminding me how this came out initially upside down. So it was like whatever this ending was, it closed out a cycle in the life in in your life. Okay, to bring you to this to a new beginning. All right, but now there's like so you've been slow moving towards delivering truth because. Or somebody is because they know the other person is like guarded and <sighs> broken hearted. But somebody's like really the other person's emotional fulfillment. Let's see. What? So I do feel, you know, watch your thoughts and self-employment. See just another um, interruption here with this reading, but at least I didn't have to stop it. So um, completely, but watch your thoughts, Libra. Okay. Because I feel what I heard was you can be your own worst enemy. So self-employment, some of you may be um, starting new businesses or like, you know, some sort of subcontractor or something like that. Let's see. What other advice do you have for Libra here? But there is a new beginning here. Yeah, see, a new dawn. Somebody is around you to help. Um, I feel like there's somebody that you can talk to. Uh, so someone wants to help you think of whom that might be and initiate contact. I feel like it's somebody that you that you look up to. Maybe they're gonna help you start this business. You're born entrepreneur and your business is surrounded by magical opportunities. So if you're like worried about money or something like that, like don't worry about it. Like that's, that's a, cause there was like some sort of like financial loss I was picking up over here. And I feel like that's going to, that's going to change. It's just like totally temporary. All right. It, it, the money may have been like slow to come in, but yeah, slow return, but it's coming. You know, this is the Knight of pentacles. This is like, stable and growing, reliable. It always makes its, the Knight of Pentacles always makes his mark. All right, so give me some cards for Libra for the month of September. Passion, forgiving and learning. Yeah, because 
I do feel like whatever this was, and what they wanted me to say was what shit show, whatever shit show this was, because this was a shit show, how somebody ended up single. <clears throat> it's like you need to forgive yourself. Um, and you're also, you're learning to forgive yourself and you're learning to forgive others in this whole process that this is what's like, I even feel like some of you may even be asking for forgiveness. Okay. This is what's like part of what's bringing in your new, um, beginning. Passion. Cause somebody's headed to their empress. bringing truth to their empress. Because remember we had that empress. I don't know where the hell she went though. <clears throat> okay, so we got passion. Release your ex. I told you something's ending. But somebody's like still a little bit pissed off here, you know? Somebody was like, and stay optimistic about your love life. Because I feel like Somebody came in with a stable offer of love towards you and maybe somebody denied it, you know, like somebody's just like super guard guarded because you're like too focused on these three cups that, that, um, are spilt instead of turning around to see that, you know, here's, here's two cups there for you. Let's see anything else here for Libra, but this is. Yeah, codependency. I'm telling you, I feel like that's the cycle that's closing out. That's what you're learning about. That's what this, like, you know, they said shit show. That's what this shit show was. That, like, all of a sudden you found yourself single. Somebody did. And, um, but now somebody's remorseful and guarded and kind of regretful. And it, it's a process of learning. Everybody involved is, is getting a lesson in life. Romantic feelings. You do have romantic feelings towards somebody. Your feelings are real and worth exploring. I feel like this is the truth that's coming out soon. You've been slow to deliver. Somebody's been slow to deliver to you or... All right, anything else here for Libra? Wow. told you somebody's on their way to their empress this is a divine connection there's a divine connection somewhere here and somebody's getting it because of like or it's coming as soon as you release your ex and stop resisting and stop being stuck in your head. Somebody's like stuck in their head and, and refusing to see that they have like this. Anyway, it's coming in very soon. But I definitely feel like some sort of living situation ended. That's why it was upside down. Possibly a marriage, um, cause that is also the marriage card. There's some form of stability. I mean, you could have moved. But something ended. And because you ended and because you walked away, it's like, and then like you go through this process of learning and forgiving and you find your abundance as being single. You're watching somebody that's single. Releasing. Yeah, and truth. Truth comes out. Truth is delivered. I feel like I'm supposed to get you one more, Libra. All right, let's see. What else for Libra? What else for Libra? What else? Counselor and clear your space. You know, some of you might have to talk to somebody or seek counsel. Clear your space. 
I feel like some of you are moving and you're just like decluttering. All right. This is part of like the releasing your ex. Like you're just getting rid of everything that like maybe reminds you of them or like, um, yeah, this is also about clearing your space is all also about, <coughs> like I said, my throat and your heart. Somebody is like really in the heartache. You guys are, are changing jobs. Some of you are changing jobs. Your life purpose is triggering a blessed career change. Okay, so if you lost your job, which is what this with the tower could have also been, is like a loss of a job. Like, don't worry about it because you needed to lose it because it's like it 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 put some like this is like the wheel of fortune. Put some wheel in, in motion to change your life, and it was a much needed change. But I feel like there was a lot of resistance toward it, and that's why the the tower had to come in. Because somebody wasn't letting go. It says, I'm with you in your time of need, helping your heart to heal. And that's what you're going through. But it says, look here, your material needs are provided as you follow your intuition and manifest your dreams into, uh, into reality. And that's like your truth, Libra. And I feel like you're getting there, you know, you know, follow your own passion. That's what this is about. And that's what you're doing. That's what you're going for. You're going for the big stuff. I mean, it's coming for you. Your new beginning. All righty, Libra. Enjoy that. Have an awesome September. And I will see you next month. Bye.